Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, or if you are new, welcome to my channel. My name is Alyssa, and growing up, my dream college was Notre Dame. I'm from Indiana. All of my relatives live in South Bend, which is where Notre Dame is. My parents are from the South Bend area, so I always really wanted to go to Notre Dame as a kid, but I ended up at IU, and I'm really happy that it worked out that way. In today's video, I have a short little Ulta haul for you guys. I got a 20% off coupon the other day, so I had to go in and buy a couple things, you know. Without further ado, let's just let's just see what I got. So they got me at the uh, little checkout area where they have all the like random products in, in the in the in the thing that's supposed to distract you. So you pick up like eight little four dollar things and it really adds up. They got me with it this time. I got a couple of face masks by Tony Moly. They are the Master Lab face masks. I got the vitamin C brightening, the hyaluronic acid hydrating, and the the ceramide moisture care face masks. I've already used two of them, so I'm gonna hold them up upside down because they're already open. This is my unopened one. I really liked the two that I've already used. The hydrating one made my skin feel super, super soft and nice. And then the brightening one toned down some of the discoloration that I had where some of my acne scarring is. I really liked those. They were $4 each. I'll definitely be using the ceramide moisture care one. I'm sure that it's gonna be just as great as all of the other ones. And then I picked up a couple Morphe brushes. I think it was just these four. They're all eyeshadow brushes. They're still in the little packaging. I got an M504, which is more of a like fanned out crease brush. And then I got an M514, which is like a super tapered skinny, but like long blending brush. I thought this would be really good for blending out things in the crease, like the, Im the immediate crease, like right in there. I got a M33 zero, which is kind of your typical crease blending brush. It's a little bit skinnier than the usual one, so it won't fan out the color so much outside of the crease. And then I also got a M518 brush, which is just another fluffy crease brush. And then I got a Maybelline mascara. I got the Total Temptations mascara. Been wanting to try this for a while. I got it in the shade Blackest Black. I heard this smells like coconuts. It does. So this is what the wand looks like. It's a big wand, but it's got like a tapered end to it. I'm pretty sure this mascara is supposed to be like lengthening, but more so volumizing. So I'm excited to give this a go. And I got another Morphe thing. I got one of the blush trios in Pop of Blush. So this is what the little unit looks like. And then these are the tones on the inside. So you get like a shimmery blush, or this could be used as a cheek topper, a matte blush, Blush and then a satin blush. And the last few things that I purchased were all flower beauty things. Um, I've been obsessed with Drew Barrymore lately, especially with all of the collaborations she's been doing with influencers. I've always really loved Drew Barrymore, but she's been kind of in the limelight recently. So I picked up a couple flower beauty things. I got a, um, what are these called? A Galaxy Glaze Holographic Lip Gloss. This is in the shade Angelic. It's a really, really pretty like champagne color with like holographic pink and like iridescent shimmer in it. It's super pretty. And then I got one of their Miracle Matte Lips. It looks like this and it's the shade Almost Nude. So I'm sure this is going to be super, super pretty. And then I picked up an eyeshadow palette. This is one of the Wonderlust eyeshadow palettes. It's called Austin. So I think there's like New York, LA, and Austin. I liked this one the best out of the three and I've had my eye on it for a while. So I picked this up. And then I also grabbed their Light Illusion Luminous Makeup, um, which which is their foundation. I got the shade, what shade did I get? Natural Beige M1. So yeah, I'm super excited to use this because I've been digging the more luminous vibe lately and I've seen really good reviews on that. So I wanted to pick it up. But like I said, this was just gonna be a super short, quick little Ulta haul. That's everything that I purchased. I think everything that I got was drugstore. They were things that had been sitting in my online Ulta cart for a while. So I figured with my 20% off coupon, why not just snack some of them. Let me know if you have recently bought anything from Ulta or if you also got a 20% off coupon and purchased some things. Let me know what you've got in the comments below. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed this quick little little sharing of things that I purchased and uh, make sure that you subscribe before you leave if you haven't yet already. I post new videos every other day. Other than that, I will talk to you guys in my next video. Thank you for watching.